is 6.50. Sure feels late. It's not actually that, you better, what if there's like something like. Breakable? Like, yeah, like, like perfume and a glass to wear. Then when the, when the UPS guy threw it on our porch, it would have, oh, this is USPS, so they're more careful. This is in our mailbox. So I'm running on the treadmill. Mm -hmm. So I look like this and you, I've been chasing around crazies all day. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, those are your pajamas and they're not really your pajamas. That, that's true. They're not really my pajamas. I wore these all day. They just look comfortable though. And it's cold. I wore them over my workout clothes. But uh, we're talking about love. I had to <laughs> unbox it. <laughs> unbox your love. So Set your love free. It's all the rage nowadays to do these subscription boxes. I've seen them for dog treats, for manly man things. Uh, Did it, start, it started like with the razors, didn't it? Well, I don't know if that started it. Or that's or part of it. I'm a Dollar Shave Club mm -hmm. member. I I get uh, I subscribe to getting razors every month. But this is different. This is a I subscription think became, box. I think it became really popular with Amazon and Amazon Prime. You think so? Maybe. Because this is the kind of thing where you don't know what's inside. I think that's the the major player here. Or the mystery, like a mystery box, mm -hmm. kind of like this, and you like mystery box of food. So we decided to give it a go. This is the, uh, there's a whole bunch of companies. So, we so this is a date box. This isn't like, yeah, it's, this it's is a, a date, date box. box. Um, and there's it's a whole bunch a of these, ranging box. from kind of activities you can do at home to full on concierge provided activities where you literally, they send you tickets and you show up. They've taken care of everything. We, what would we do here in Utah? I, well, I don't know. I, it was, I was going to try it, but try it was like $200. It was like $200 a date. So, We'll do it one of these times, but for now, I figured we'll have to for our fans <laughs> with new baby and stuff. Yeah, so you guys know what it's all about. New baby and stuff. Oh yeah. This is a more home centric that. one where does it come with cash to pay the babies? I'm just saying, the that would be awesome. It comes it came with cash, cash to pay the babysitter. babysitter. <laughs> no. Okay, but let's look at the let's open okay. it. So this one is Unbox Love. What do we get? Unbox, and it, unbox your love. They have uh, we're a monthly subscription. I did a three month. For Christmas gift. Not contra guys, yeah, guys, it was a Christmas. Attention. Yeah, so three I months. got nothing underneath the tree for Christmas, but it was coming in the mail. No, just I, you got <laughs> I'm just lotion. I got, I got lotion. That you get every year. <laughs> so oh yeah, that's okay. So there we go. Unboxing. So we've not we have not opened this, we have not seen what's inside of it. We don't know what to No expect. idea. Other than you know, Hold I, on, I guys. a little bit of other than a little bit of reviews or a little bit of research online. But Okay, so we start pulling out like inside the box. Hey, hey, Cameron, Lori. Oh, look, they have oh, our it's name. Personalized. Personalized. Yes. Oh. And it I has. Special. We're so excited about this month's date. It's all about the words you can use to express your love. Oh, you like words. I love words. I love being um, told. Words are some of your strongest tools that you can possess in your relationship. They can create and build your partner, or they can destroy them and tear them down. One zinger can erase 20 acts of kindness. That's kind of like if you start your car, you have to drive it like 20 miles for every time you start it. Right. Wait, what? Yeah, don't worry about it. Don't know, anyway, no all right. So here we go. So there we go. So it starts out with Ooh, step um, one steps with steps stuff to do. to do on your date, and you can plan to do this. So we're opening it now to kind of get get the idea of what it is, so we can plan this weekend or something like that to be able to put the kids yeah, down. Yeah, because do when you got kids, you might because I think some of them are like, don't open it up until it's time to do the date. But. If you got kids, you gotta know how yeah, long. Yeah, know what to How do. long your date's gonna be? Cause. <laughs> so we have step one, write a love note. Oh. Step two, I'm getting emails over here. Step two, uh, your love mailbox. Oh. Um, you can just hand your your partner their love letter, or you can deliver them using your new love note mailbox. Oh. We get a love note mailbox. Yes. Uh, step three, play some banana grams. This is like our. Step four, a game to play every day. We have a, a love journal that we write to each other, and we used to. It's right. To we used other. to. It's been a while. So, and, and the thing about this is, it kind of this is. Oh look, the five love languages. This is perfect. We yeah, that's our this. thing actually. This is a book. That's we, our thing. We, we see, totally. See, we totally. He knew that my language was words, so. We totally. That's uh, one of the five love languages. Love this book and recommend it. So anyway, the whole point is, is it's a surprise for both of you. It takes a little bit, and, and at this point, we're not like. I'm not like going, oh, take the thought out of dating. I don't want to think about it. But we're both so exhausted at the end of the day <laughs> from creativity, you know, with the kids and stuff, that it's nice to have at least once a month one date kind of taken out of your hands. One date planned. So this, the rest of the stuff is talking about the 
um, five love languages, and then some uh, the some quizzes, the tests you can take so you can find out. And that's important, guys and gals, to learn about the five love, love languages. So there's two tests, one for each one of you, so you can look at it. So we'll redo that because I'll double check. Although I know I'm, I'm pretty much, I'm sure what my answers are yeah, and your answers they're, are. They're saying questions to ask each other at the end of the day. Oh. Uh, this is the banana gram. I've never heard of a banana gram, but it looks like a banana. It sounds like it has marbles in it. I'm not quite sure why you'd have marbles in a banana. No, oh, it's, it's got words. It's got words. Oh, it's a game. Okay, that would make sense. Fine. It's like Scrabble. You're going to win. I'm so bad. <laughs> so... He makes up words that don't exist. <laughs> oh, no, this looks like my game because you can make up words that don't exist. Oh. No, I don't know. We'll find out. <laughs> it's, it's ages seven and up, so I'm probably in trouble. Oh, I say ages three, but no, that. No, yeah, well, that's seven. the pair. That's the pair one. The pair one seven is, is banana is is seven. And up. So it's a game we get to play probably before, uh, not before, probably after because. And then you can I'm have sure a date with involved. your kid after. <laughs> no, let's not do that. So there's an activity, and I'm sure there's a little more instructions like, oh, here's some love notes. You know what are they? Notes. What is now? Do they rotate these boxes like so? Next, so so if all of our viewers. Um, decide to do this, are they going to get this box? Like, are we I don't know. a surprise? I don't or are know. they going to send them something else new next month? Maybe. I, I, if you love box people, what is it? Uh, no. Unbox love people. I hope you don't, like, recycle too often. Um, I just cards. Monthly cards. Like, like oh, that's an advert. Okay. An and lastly is this box. I don't have my knife on me. I usually need sharp things for this kind of thing. I'll let you do that. So I'm a little bit sad and happy all at the same time there's no food involved in this one. Because undoubtedly there'd be something sugary and bad for you if we had made something. Well good. That means we could we'll always just eat track. the zucchini chips I made this afternoon. We'll stay on track with our goals while we... Oh, oh, look at that. It's a little mailbox. Funny story about this mailbox. Not this mailbox, <laughs> but saying. one exactly like it. Oh, it does. It has a thingy. It has a thingy. We had one of these when I was a kid. I don't, I don't know that it was a love note mailbox, but <laughs> um, I commandeered it at Christmas time. I think it was a Christmas decoration. And I used to send the siblings notes and or candy in here. Here's. And I used to think, you know, I should find one of those for future. But now we get to write love notes in it. Stick bananas in it. <laughs> so this doesn't seem like a very super long date, obviously, but enough to play some games, uh, go through well, this. It gives you different this ideas. takes some time to go through and to and, really well, and give get, it justice. Well, I would say this one is all about actually not the date, but dating each other through the day. Yeah. Well, this is making, this is the kind of thing you do on the date to discover. Yeah, and then and then these, this is like continuing because the five love languages is all about making connections through the day and if you get hot <laughs> so that you can continue to to communicate on the level that your partner needs to be communicated on. And we were just talking about that today actually you said I'm not being not me but we were talking about <laughs> fulfilled with different things uh, in our lives you know my my language is is words of affirmation and I'm not getting that from what I'm doing and um, Again, not for me. I, I, I affirmate all the time, right? <laughs> um, but anyway, so there you go. We're excited to see what the next month brings us. It's just, yeah, it's just something good, like you said, not taking the thought out of a date, but giving you an idea you might not have thought of before because who hasn't Googled date ideas? Date ideas, <laughs> exactly. So date there you go. Plan. Date night idea. So anyway, yeah, yeah, this weekend we know what we're doing. But then again, I still think we probably need to make some kind of food because this banana is making me hungry. <laughs> banana ice cream? 